Hello Share Bears. Today's video is a haul video because a thing happened and okay let's start from the beginning. I am on a no-buy. That being said I have not bought any makeup for myself since September of last year. This happened in February but but big but I did not pay any money for these said products because I'm part of shoppers optimum card and now they've combined and become PC optimum so I used my points to buy all this so I don't think this is a fail in the no buy portion because I did not personally pay money for these. This is money that has accumulated through buying necessities for my household. So Shoppers has a little grocery section. They also happen to have my favorite coffee that I make at home. And of course it's a drugstore so they have pharmaceutical stuff. And that is how I accumulated these points. But there are some points from way back in the last year, the beginning of the year, that were from purchasing makeup. So, this is a no buy success because I didn't pay any money for it. There you go. <laughs> so, the first thing I did get was my Essence Lash Princess False Lash Effect Mascara because I haven't had one of these in my collection for a long time. I do not have this open. It's going in the drawer just for when I'm done with another one because I love this mascara. This is my holy grail, ride or die. Enough said. I've spoke about this mascara so often it's just getting repetitive now. The next thing I bought was a collection that was from Christmas and it's from Quo and Orly and it's it was in a package with 12. It was like an advent calendar. So this, needless to say, even though I did not spend money on this, was also on sale. It was half the price of what it had been at Christmas or before Christmas. So it's a nail polish collection and there are 12 nail polishes, little mini nail polishes, which I thought were so cute and I have fallen in love with one and I want the full size of it. But I have not used these, just I have my color wheels, which I don't have in front of me, so I can't even show you them. And I really don't want to go digging to find them in my nail care area. So, what it was, these are a collaboration with Quo and Orly, and there is a little top coat, which that didn't excite me too much. But there were all these little tiny mini colors. So I will go through them and tell you what the colors are. So this one is Love My Nails and it is a red with a slight shimmer to it. Just a slight shimmer to it. And this one is Aloe Goodbye and it is gray with a green shift to it. I'm actually looking so forward to playing with these, but I have nail polishes in my project bands and I'm kind of trying to stay away from them there. The next one is Barely There. And this one is a white and it's pretty solid. It's not a shimmer just a slight shimmer. The next one is Power Pack. This one has a pearlescent shimmer. It's almost 
pinky and purple at the same time. And then there is Heaven Scent, which is a pearl type shade and it has gold running through it. Probably my least favorite of them. It's pretty, but it's not my ooh la la. I need to use that. Next is Stronger Than Ever, and this one is a red, but it has gold shimmer running throughout it. So pretty, very Christmassy, obviously, because it was a Christmas product. I'm saving my favorite for last. <laughs> the next is the Antidote, and it is a purple berry toned color. There is no shimmer to this, it is just straight berry tone color, which is very pretty. Then there is Detox My Socks Off. I love the names of these, by the way. This is like a minty green, but with just a slight blue shift. It's very, very pretty, very subtle when you swatch it. It's not like really bam in your face. Next is Distressed Denim. This is a bluey purple color with a slight shimmer to it. Very pretty. Then there is Pep in Your Step which is a pink. It does have a slight shimmer to it. More of a pearlescent shimmer than anything to wow. And it doesn't show up as pink as it is on my monitor. It's not showing up as pink as it is in the bottle. So. And my favorite, and this is the one I really, 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 really want <laughs> full size of. This is Fairy Godmother. Is that not beautiful? And when it's swatched, it's even better. I can't wait to use this one. It's like purple, but it's got pink and peach and gold and oh, so pretty. So I got that. That was $20 or 20 optimum points to get that PC optimum points. And I got two other nail polishes and they're both by the Sally Hansen Complete Salon Manicure. The first one is a blue attitude which obviously is a blue and it's showing up much more royal on my camera than it is. It's more of a dusty blue or a country blue I like to call it. And the next one was Tropic Thunder, which is a gray with a blue shift to it. Very, very, very pretty. Now, I did say that if I was going to be purchasing anything with money, it would be nail polish or nail products. So, that's not too bad. I didn't spend money on those. I did, however, buy two makeup items because, you know, I couldn't help myself. So the first one is a Maybelline Color or Super Stay Matte Ink in the color Lover. And I can say I have tried this. I love the color. I love the applicator. This stuff is so sticky. Oh my gosh. It doesn't dry down. It stays sticky. But it doesn't wear off. It's kind of annoying. It has a nice scent. I don't mind the scent. So I guess that's okay but it is so sticky so, I don't know how I like that this was 
$8.99 for that. These were $9.99. I had a lot of points. And the last thing I bought was something that... Okay, I just could not buy this because I have all the other ones. That being said, this is the CoverGirl True Naked Smoky Palette. And in my defense, I do not have smoky palettes. I don't have the Naked Smoky. I wish I had gotten it, but I did not get it before it was discontinued. So this is something that... I don't actually have in my collection and I don't regret buying it except for the price because my other ones were $8.99 this was $14.99 and I bought the other ones at the same place but obviously I bought them on sale because this was $14.99 and I can't see them jumping that much over the course of a year so I do love these colors I did swatch them I'm not going to swatch them now because as it is this is driving me nuts because I can feel how sticky it is even without it being on my lips but I do love the colors in this and I'm looking forward to actually playing with this and giving my opinion as you know I love the roses and the naked one and the jewels from this collection not a fan of the golden but I do have it so that's everything for this haul. I do intend to do some more on this and give a full review of this. I can already tell you this isn't my favorite lip product by far, but I bought it so I will try and use it. The color is beautiful. It smells good. The applicator is awesome. It's just that stickiness. I'm going to have to try and figure out a way to work around that. And the color, it lasts. I'll say that. It lasts. So that's everything. Much love. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye for now.